Oh, Tumblr, you've done it again. My favorite picture on Tumblr ever. I'm laughing so hard because I thought of 22 and said 22 out loud at 4 Oh my god. <laughs> 3D3. 44. I realized my mistake. I saw this ad in 2005 and I'm still wondering why her head is so tiny. Why? Why is her head so tiny? No. I've got it. Those skin color things to the side are not her shoulders. They are actually a chair. Oh. My Uga King for God. Why were they vegetables? Why did they have to be vegetables? The idea for VeggieTales came in the early 90s when Phil Vischer was testing out animation software as a medium for children's videos. Due to the limitations of the software available to him at the time, he chose to avoid that technical production hurdle of creating characters with arms, legs, or hair. His first animation model was an anthropomorphic candy bar. When his wife suggested that parents might prefer a hero who promoted healthier eating habits, he began basing characters on fruits and vegetables. I have never felt this level of closure in my life. I'm so satisfied right now. Yo, VeggieTales doesn't get the love it should. To be honest, in the early days, it was five people making them out of Phil Fisher's garage in Peoria, Illinois. No one has succeeded with 3D animation yet. Toy Story was two years away, but VeggieTales did it. Pixar even called them and asked how they did the cheek puffing animation in the early days. Pixar called them. Bad props, VeggieTales. Stop everything. Sharon, hold my calls. I need to stare at this newborn hippo. How dare anything that grows up so big start so tiny? How dare it? What on earth? This is the cutest thing ever. Oh man, I'll steal one from the zoo. Oh my Jesus, I want one. <clears throat> That's a fucking guinea pig. You weird hair. Like, it can't be cold or warm hair. When you touch it, it's just hair temperature. This, I swear to God. I just walked past two construction dudes and one of them just said, I don't think they're right-handed or left-handed. They're just dogs. So, what do you guys have planned for Valentine's Day? Murder. That's the spirit. My sister was blasting Wrecking Ball from her room, so when the chorus came in, I burst in and threw a yoga ball at her. One might say that I came in like a wrecking ball. She's still yelling at me. Dude, sleeping is nice because you're not actually dead and you're not awake, so it's a win-win situation. It's like being dead without the commitment, an open relationship with death, death with benefits, an every night stand. All right, dude, we get it. So, I can either bake these cookies at 400 degrees for 10 minutes or 4,000 degrees for one minute. Nick, no! That's not how you bake cookies, friend! Blore it? Nick, no! How about 4 million degrees for one second? Nick, you're going to burn your house down! I'm going to harness the fucking sun and make cookies! Nick, <laughs> You're either the friend or the Nick. A homeless guy just said to me, do you tell jokes to make people laugh or to make people think you're funny? And that is the most profound shit I've ever experienced.